What's good, you two? It's your boy, Coffee with the Foe, and I'm back at you with another video. So if you like sneak content I've been bringing, what I need you to do is like, comment, subscribe to this YouTube channel. If you ain't subbed up, what are you doing, man? And if you is subbed up, tell somebody to tell somebody to tell them and all of them to come on over, like, comment, subscribe, all that good, good, good stuff. Man, pack completed. But quick story aside on this. So my TikTok group chat, we got a we on WhatsApp, we got a group chat, and we we be sending each other links, we be cracking on each other, we be wrecking on each other, everything. And extra butter restocked a bunch of shoes. And there was a pair of SBs that restocked. And shout out to the homie Ray. Ray get on there and he's like, it said it won't deliver to either one of my addresses. So we all sitting there like, it got to be something with you. Then the homie Manny hop on there. Same thing with Manny. It's saying it won't deliver. A couple of more people, I think. In the group chat, tried and wouldn't deliver. So I was like, hey, let me just get on here and see. Because I kind of do need this shoe. But I ain't trying to spend no more money because I already went crazy. It's March 29th. I officially bought 23 pairs of sneakers. Don't know when this is going to drop. Sometime in April. Beginning of April for sure. But... I bought this shoe a week ago. And I'm like, yeah, I really don't need the shoe, but I do need the shoe, if that makes sense. Because this is the third time this shoe released. First time it released on sneakers. I didn't take an L. I went for the other pair. And I, I hit on that pair. Then the second time it released, it did. they did a, a, a reserve. A SB Reserve. And leading up to finding out about the SB Reserve, I was like, I'm going to go for this pair. I'm going to go for this pair. Last minute, I went for the Vintage Green. If y'all haven't seen that review, I highly suggest y'all go check that out. And I was like, I went for the Vintage Green, even though both of them, the resale wasn't high. It was like right at retail, a little bit above. Still wasn't bad. So I was like, i get them. This time, it's like, I. Let me see if they'll let me check out. I get in there, type my size in, put my credit card info in, address, all that, get to check out, and it checks out. I'm like, well, I got a Nike SB Purple Box. I, I wanted the shoe. I wanted the shoe for sure. And this is the Nike S. Nike SB Dunk Low PRM. The colorway is Coconut Milk Light Bone. Seven and a half men. Nine women. My size. I spent. Retail was $125 plus tax plus $10 shipping. $145 all together. Retail. And what I spent was. Basically, kind of what they was going for, a little bit less, but this is my extra butter receipt right there. We don't care about the receipt. We care about these. Man. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Like, if I'm being honest, if you want, if you wanted these shoes... I feel like it should have been an easy pickup for y'all because it's that third time releasing. But if you want the now, if you want the Burgundy Crush, that was hella easy. When I say hella easy, I mean it was hella easy to where they keep the Burgundy Crush is the one that sits. But this one, it's like the more limited pair that I feel like that's hard to get. But man, let's start off. You got your standard Nike SB outsole. I love 
how right in the middle you got that red right there to make it stand out, make it pop, make it, whoo, that little color of red right there, fire. Then you come up, you got your standard SB outsole going around that thing. I love the uh, red thread that goes right there. I love how that red thread sticks out. It does come with an extra set of red laces, which all SBs, don't quote me on this, but I think all SBs come with an extra set of laces. That's, that's one shoe where you can expect, I feel like, to get an extra set of laces. The three pair of SBs I got all came with extra laces. And this is the, I don't even think this is a collab. Because City of Love, I don't even think it's a collab or not. But man, then you got that, um, what, what's the actual colorway? Colorway is... You got a light bone coconut upper. I love I love the suede on the overlays. Like you got that suede right there. It's some okay suede, I ain't gonna lie. Then you got like this uh it's like it feel like vinyl material. But I cannot think polyester. That's what it is. It's like you got a polyester toe box. It comes with, I don't know if you'll call this the, the coconut or the light bone laces. Then your, uh, your tongue is polyester. You got Nike, Nike over SB and polyester. And you got the red line going across it. But what I love is that insole. Not the insole. Yeah, the insole. See that black hand touching the white hand with Nike SB and then on this one the hands are a little lighter like a cream right there I really think that touch is dope then you got this is like silk like a like a silk sock liner and that coconut then you got uh you got like some thick thick padding like right here but man you got the dang the Nike swoosh is leather I didn't even know that that's not suede that's leather I love I love how it how it stands out with the Nike swoosh and all that but let's get to the real meat and potatoes. I didn't even realize this one had that same thing on it. I have pulled these out. As y'all can see. This is a shoe that's more wearable. That can be an everyday beater. And whatnot. In my opinion. This shoe is that shoe you pull out. Special occasions. Summertime. You know you just want to throw something out. Throw a little linen suit on. Yes, I'm old enough to where I'm about to start getting into the linen suits for the summer. With this, whoo, a clean white linen suit. Even a red linen suit would go perfect with these. Go crazy. But looking at both of these, I do like the coconut better. Like, I, when pictures came out, I love this burgundy crush better. Just from the pictures, having it in hand, I love it. I love the leather overlay. I love everything about this shoe. But when I got this shoe, oh, it was love. Love, L-O-V-E-E-E -E 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 at first sight. It was love at first sight. But y'all let me know which one you like better, Burgundy Crush or Coconut Milk. Do you have both of them? Do you have either one of them? If you got one or the other, do you plan on completing the pack? Because I'm not going to lie. This was a must-have for me. This one was, this one was like, eh, okay. But this was the must-have. This was the one where it's like, all right, I'm good. I don't need to complete the pack. But when Manny's pair came in, when OG Polo's pair came in on TikTok, 
And when the more and more I start seeing these, I'm like, okay, okay, I gotta complete the path. But like always, y'all be blessed, y'all be safe, arrest the killers, I stand on that. Respect female sneakerheads, I stand on that. Respect black women, I stand on that. Hey, like I always say, God is dope, I can't say that enough, and I stand on that. Want to let y'all know, y'all be blessed, y'all be safe. To the next one, we about to get to this own feed of these Nike SB City of Love. The sense of peace I feel is amazing To know that I'm yours And you're all mine Why I gotta make it complicated Running to hide the way I feel inside But when the stormy days come You're my sunshine I was strolling down the trail of tears Headed to know Strolling down the train 